hemmed in my pocket. Oh no, I forgot my wallet today. Honestly, I just reminded me then. Because people call me tight. They go, Josh, you never put your hand in your pocket. Mainly because they're women's jeans. Women's jeans are funky, aren't they? They come up right up past the belly button. But they don't have any front pockets. They have no front pockets. So what I do is, I put my wallet in the back pocket. And then you're dangerous then. It just gives people an excuse to touch you. You know what I mean? Touch you. Have a good with you. But I forgot it today. Because I said to my mum, I'm going to buy her a vape. She's got out of hospital. Because she smokes too much, she drinks too much, she does everything way too much. She had too many kids. That's why she had triplets. She had to beat everybody else. She's very competitive. You should see her in a netball game. Honestly. 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 So I'm going to buy it a new vape, but I forgot my wallet. Not because I'm backtracking now. I was halfway to work. There was Van Gate and Puddle Gate all in one. The van went over the puddle. Shh, over me. Honestly. I thought I was waterproof. My grandma always said to me, Joshua, you're waterproof. You could be the next Aquaman. No, nope, you were lying, Grandma. So I need to try and get back to the house after work quickly to pick up the wallet and get all the way back into Ashton because I live in Staley Bridge. She's made to me at three. She's going to have to wait round. Then I'm going to have to buy her an umbrella because she'll be waiting round in the rain. Welcome to Tameside today, everybody. It's Feel Good Friday! You've got me all the way until 3pm. It's a busy show. Little Jordan and Leanna joining us from 12pm. From 1pm, start of the original lineup of Freddie and the Dreamers, Derek Quinn, will be joining us for the whole hour. But before that, our very own star, he needs no introduction... Oh, I don't want to put it down. I'm getting all groovy now, Stingray. Say hello. 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 We're in again. Good morning, everybody. Here we go again. Day five of the week, and Stingray has got more paper than ever. Dun dun. What have you got now? Well, that paper. Today, What's happening? We go to the Grafton Centre oh, and hide. Yes. Is it the health checkup? It's a health checkup. There we go. How about that? There we go. Are you going yourself? Of course. Do you need an MOT doing? Oh, yeah. Are you going for a checkup or to take pictures? I'm doing both. Because <laughs> your chest is too hairy. Do they do waxes Direct. as well? Yeah. It's a lovely shirt, but you've done one button up starting from the bottom. The rest, it's like, ooh. It's like, do you know when Burt Reynolds did that? Is it Rolling Stones or Playboy? What did he do? Playboy, and he had that rug as well. That's right. You look like the rug. Do I? You've got a oh. polar bear on your chest. Well, have a vacuum cleaner for it. <laughs> I'm going to shake and vacuum your chest. All we have to do. Lay down, Stingray. What else are we doing? Right, so that's good. Right. What time's that on? This evening is a nice one at the Oaklands Hall in Hyde. Right. It's the Rotary Club last night of the proms. What happened to the first night? I don't know what happened to that one. We've that got the last one, though. We've got the last we've one. We've ran out. So you're on to the last <laughs> night of the proms at the Oaklands Hall in Hyde. Do we know what time it is or how much it is? Yeah, it's about 7 o'clock. I've got okay. 7 o'clock down here. Yeah, I think tickets are 10 quid as well. Yeah, that'd, that'd be good. Oh, well, you know more than I do, and I'm, I'm going. I'm professional. I come here, I oh. read my script, I have auto-cue in corner. S That's very good. Saturday. <laughs> Why are you announcing it like that? Tomorrow is Saturday. Kids. Old Hyde Post Office, Corporation Street. Yeah. Launch of a Hyde photo exhibition and Hyde 2019 calendar. Really? A post yes. office calendar? No, it used to be called, it was the post office in Hyde. And Haven't they turned it to a... They're using it now for other things. I, isn't it a cafe? I'm sure it's, it's probably a, a cafe right. as well. Yeah, yeah I walk past somebody. Street, yeah. Say, oh, what you do? Oh, I've just been for a brew with my dad. Oh, where yeah. at? Oh, this cafe over there yeah, it used to be it's post the old, office. Um, yeah. The old, the old uh, post office. You get a free stamp with every cup of tea. Yeah. Not even first class. All right, no, that's all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. not bad. What are you doing Sunday or Sunday, Saturday? I've got one, which is at St George's Church in Mosley, and it's a civic service for the mayor up there. Oh, the mayor up oh. there. The Mosley have a different mayor to Tayside? Yes, they do. They've Ooh. got their own mayor, Mosley. We're independent up there. <laughs> <laughs> but I do believe uh, Tameside mayor is attending. Oh, <gasps> they're going to be in the same place? Yes. What happens then? Well, there could be a battle. <gasps> to the end. I'll be the referee. Uh, you, you're Lord Voldemort, two ladies. Oh, don't. You'll enjoy it too much, Stingray, you dirty sod. Are you staying around for a little while? Just of a little course. while? Of course. Why not? Thank you, Stingray. Here's Paul McCartney, brand new one from his new album. Egypt Station, it's called it. Oh, God, it's so groovy. It's called Back in Brazil. So we 
raise a family as the clouds roll by, making pictures of us in the sky. Paul McCartney, back in Brazil. That's the highlight from his new album. That's why I got it especially to play it on air. See? They're all very good, though. Come on to me. Do, 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 do. He has fit you as well. Fit you. Right. Watch how you say it, Stingray. Will, it's I for will. you. I promise. But it's very good. The album is out now. We're still joined by Stingray. The song started. He goes, oh, oh, those birds. Are, are, are those, are those oh, pigeons? Are those pigeons? And bongo drums. Uh, ba -da 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 -da. Then you had a pigeon story. Will you tell us your pigeon story? Oh, I can tell you that one. I had to go and photograph a load of pigeons being released from a wagon. What they do, they take them to a place in a great big wagon and all the pigeons are in there, the homing pigeons. Uh, I got set up to take the picture uh, and they release them. And what's the first thing they do? They all poo. <laughs> and I crop for it. I was covered in it. Why do they not poo in the, in the, in the thing? No, they wait to come out. They, they're devious, they were waiting, the pigeons. They saw me standing there and they said, we'll get him. <laughs> Was it embarrassing? <sighs> did you carry on taking your pictures? Oh, yes, I got my pictures. Did you get... A, well, I guess they just has loads of poo in the pictures. Oh, yeah, Does yeah. That, Where are these pictures now? It's a poo shot. <laughs> is, that, is that what were you going for? Are you known as the poo photographer, Stingray? <laughs> oh, what are you like? Oh, pigeons, though. Do you know when you see one with... Only one foot and then one toe on that foot, and I it's know. like the Terminator pigeons, I call them, because yeah. obviously they've got 15 lives and they, they won't die. Right. So I avoid them, Stingray. Oh, yeah. I avoid them. I went to the shop in town on Wednesday, and there's a gaggle of women out there laughing and eh, smoking. Oh, I love it. I love it. So we've got this, we've got a shop pigeon. He's a friend of the shop. He's called Clive. Oh, there he is now, our friend Clive. This is little pigeon. Honestly, it looks like it's been doused. In gasoline, set a light, but it's got, still going, brruh, 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 and it's still going. The Terminator pigeon. Is that on one leg? It was on one leg. He had barely any feathers, and these women are there. Oh, there's our Clive. He always comes round on a Wednesday. Oh. So I went in the shop with Joel, bought a couple of bits, and this pigeon's just stood outside, like, Waiting. like it's time for you. And, <laughs> and the lady behind the counter, oh, that's just Clive. We don't worry about Clive. <laughs> He's one pigeon we don't have to worry about. <laughs> Oh, pigeons. What do you do this weekend, personally? I know you're always working. Well, this weekend, uh, we've, we have, as I say, we have got um, one of my grandchildren. He's 21 this weekend. Oh, that's so a big one! It is a big one. So we're having a bit of a party for him. And uh, Is he uh, handsome? We went out, he is very handsome. He went out um, last night to um, a restaurant in, in Upper Mill. Um, and we had a meal there. It was quite good. Was that to do with his birthday? Okay, that was all to do with his birthday. Oh, what did you get him? Anything? Uh, yeah, he's got um, a bracelet round, round his oh. neck. A neck bracelet, yeah. A necklace? <laughs> a, ne a necklace, that's more like it. Yeah, because I don't think a bracelet will fit, would it? <laughs> it wouldn't get his it's like here. a bracelet, but it goes... It, 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 it goes it goes round the neck. Well, for his 22nd, you can give him a signed picture of me. Oh, OK. All the kids want one these days. Aye, all right, then. Yes, yeah. they come free with the GCSE results. Stingray, everybody! Thank you. <laughs> This way, Ray Stingray, my Ray, man Ray, Ray Ray, he's gone. He's on to the Grafton Centre for an MOT. He did say he's going to drop his trousers, but I'm not worried at all. Quite the contrary, I'm quite excited. The communards, don't leave me this way. Welcome to Feel Good Friday. I'm your host, Joshua Little House. We've got loads of great music on way, if I do say so myself. We have your lunchtime love song in the next hour as well, and your daily dose of the Bradshaws. We have guests galore today, which is very, very, very exciting. If you want to request some music or get in touch with the show just to tell us what you're doing this weekend, it's so simple. 8228, start your message with the word Tameside. Or you can email us, studio at tamesideradio.com. Oh, the rain's battering the windows, but we're safe indoors. I'm going to help you. Tameside's home of more variety. Continues. Because you know I'm all about that bass, about that bass. Next. <laughs> 